Hello, this is Arthur from the HD Sensei Rotor Machinery Company. Uh, firstly, we produce many kinds of Sensei Rotor. Uh, now, let me introduce you how to convert 2D to 3D files. What we use are the, screen, are the gray scale BMP file, as you can see here. The jitters, the last dinner, Buddha, Shram. Winners, House, Cloud, Tiger. Chair Mo, Dragon, Bird, Tellis, Confucius, Beautiful Girl, Lightning, Rabbit, a lot of kinds of uh, <coughs> animal. China Empire, Swall. Dragon. Anyway, there are a, there are a lot of uh, this kind of uh, BMP file here, which are which can be provided to you by mail by network. Uh, now we use okay, we use this 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 one to show how to. Can convert it to 3D. Really, what we use is uh, GD Paint 5.19. Firstly, a file import all files. We choose from here. We choose BMP. As you can see, this is all the uh, files type which are supported by the software, such as the DXF, EPS, IGS, this is a G GDP, GPG, NC file, PNG, STL. Three, this is a this is a kind of 3D file. Uh, another type is IGS, and uh, some other kinds of file type. This is BMP. Open it, put it to original position. Use the middle button on the mouse to uh, zoom in and zoom out. As you can see, this is a two D. This is a, actually it's a picture, a grayscale picture. There are many. Now, select it, transform. This is the first step to uh, to change the size. For example, if you need uh, 200 mm by 200 mm. Okay. If you type. Like this, and then on the art surface, standard surface, uh, image texture is the BMP to mesh. Then remember to click it on this photo, and this is the height. Uh, there are two kinds of color interpretation one is black highest, the other is white highest. The height, for example, we can select a 8. This can be adjusted in the following steps. Okay, now we got a mesh type and we delete this BMP file. So, this is the, the conversation, this conversion is already done. This is shaded. Now it has been to our three D files. We can adjust it further more.
in this uh, virtue scaffolding tool. Don't remember to select it. If you think this one is too, the depth is too small, you can choose the model transform V here and here. For example, we double the depth to one six and the uh, scale Z. Now, as you can see, it's much better now. The eyes, the nose, the mouth, the hair, the air, the hair. Every detail is very perfect. So on the next step, we can make the tool pass through this mesh file tool pass, tool pass wizard, surface finish. So as you can see, this is cut depth. So top hit is zero. The cut depth is 16. Next step. Here, choose a suitable, suitable tool. For example, we use this one, flat, 30 degree, and uh, 0 0.2 on the nose of this tool. Next step. This is spindle speed, the fit rate, and uh, the step over. Uh, remember, the step over is very important. If you want to get a very beautiful shining, Shining one, you can uh, input one, uh, zero point one, or even smaller, zero point zero eight. But if you want to make it very fast, and you can make it to zero point two. Next step, and uh, finish. So this is the final tool pass, which you can output it. Also, every before every step, you need to select it and tool pass tool pass uh, template. There are a lot of other functions. Tool pass template library, tool library, material library. And you can also export two passes to the desktop with the name when when open it, uh, save it. Feature theory is under uh, left down. Okay, two pass num one hundred and thirty four. Okay. Now you get when NC files, which can be used for for the NC Studio for the CNC rotor machine. So this is a basic, simple step of how to convert it from BMP 2D file to 3D file by this ZDPen software. Uh, as you can see, there are many kinds of other. 
files. It's the same. The step is the same, and it's very simple. Flower house dragon Buddha flower go. Okay, we make it again using another files. Delete it. On the file, first step, file, import all files from uh, here. Open it. Put to original position. Zoom out. Two D display. Now it's two D. Select it on the transform and the scale. If you think it's too big, you can make it. You can also same proportion. Okay, and on the other surface, image texture, BMP to mesh, click it, this is the head, for example, 12, click it, okay, now you get a mesh, delete the original BMP file, select it, work to sculpting tool here, F6, so now you get a sculpture, you get a 3D. You can zoom in to see the detail. So very simple. The next step is the same, you can select it and make the tool pass. But we don't make it again here. It's the uh, same. We don't need to repeat it. So I hope you can understand this step. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.